Welcome to Kokpai. Stick at your bang down. That's all I can say. Come to Kokpai. I'm shopping. <laughs> yeah, but... This is another What's in Cape Town video. We're in Cork Bay and we're going to be joined by Colleen who knows this area really well. Hi there, yeah, I'm Colleen and I do know the area really well. I love to meander along this road. I love to shop, I love to browse, I love to absorb this Cork Bay culture. So join me, we're going to have a fantastic day. We're at the Cork Bay Village Square. Clothing. There's some really kick-ass signage that you can put up in your house or on your gate or on your kid's door, your husband's door. Hi, my name is Bronwyn and my shop is called Boca and Bloma and we are situated in the village square. And also there's a bunch of paper flowers in there that I really want to take home. It's called Shoreline and I sell only beautiful South African goods. I'm such a beach girl. I'm not close to the water, I'm nothing. Railway House, one of my favourites. You know, it's a treasure trove of stuff. Um, second hand, old furniture, wonderful, fabulous to browse. We are in Kopei. The shop is called Moon, and we sell clothing and upmarket jewelry. Gosh, I think fairies live here. element of surprise is what you find around every corner of every lane um, you think you're getting one thing and you end up getting so much more. We're in Colbe Thriving Post in Colbe and we sell old second hand goods. I remember growing up on Hot Stuff and Casper the Friendly Ghost and the Mad Magazine. Who remembers Alfred E. Newman with a gap in his tooth? We are going to Cape to Cuba to get a coffee because we're reaching the top of the road before we turn around and do the other side of the street going back again. I, I think that is so cool. You, you're sitting at a bar and you're watching the harbour and next thing your view's gone because the train is like this far from your face is awesome. Uh, down to the harbour, of course, we're in Cork Bay. <laughs> Cork Bay, a place for trinkets, good food, boats and trains. <laughs> What's the dog's name? That's amazing. Amazing? Yeah. And that's Diamond. Di Diamond and amazing. And this is Luca. <laughs> Hello guys. Manuka. Manuka. If you want to go and see a really authentic South African fishing uh, harbour working, this boat's just come in. Michael here is a fisherman. My name is Michael. I'm one of the local fishermen. I've got some fish on the table today for you. I've got some red snapper, red roman and some bonito tunas for you today. Yeah, you're looking at about almost two kilos. Fish off the boat. like these um, little village shots they got where they're actually like a 3D, you can actually touch and feel the picture, I think they're very nice. You can't imagine what it looks like on a big day when, when the massive winter swells hit this wall. I'm going to have to show you a picture, here you go. 
Yeah, that picture is exactly where I'm standing right now. Great test by fish, lovely local art. I just bought myself a bag from Malawi, a backpack for my travels. So there you have it, plus the boats and the smells and everything else. We are Corfe Modern Gallery. We have been around for just over a decade. Um, we focus primarily on contemporary art. We also do our own textiles and it's been a part of the Corfe community for quite a while. I think there's some magnificent art here. I'm not an art collector. I wish I could afford to be, but Kentridge, Beasy Bailey, fantastic ceramics, beautiful sculptures. I can spend all day here. You won't believe the other side of the road has got a ton of things to see. So we're going to rush through and check them out. Bang, 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 bang. beautiful place to look at these old historical books, collector's items. But what is more exciting is I discovered these bones that kind of lie all over the place. The Kauai Gallery. So if you're going to come to Cork Bay, come in the alleyways because that's where you're going to find all the little treasures that you don't see off, off the main road. possibly see all of this in one video so listen get yourself down to Cork Bay and walk the main road. We are in Papagayo. We are in Cork Bay in Scar. Such a mix of bohemian and transy a little bit of uniqueness you know. Sweet old jester where we can get those Beautiful old fashioned sweets that I grew up with, like, like stars and apricots. Let's go buy sweets! Hi! How's that smell? Oh, that smell is <laughs> this amazing! Is just my favourite, one of uh. my absolute favourites in Cork oh, Bay. God, I'm, so I'm at the sweet old jester, my name is Lizette, and this is a fun shop. I've got a really sweet tooth, so it's probably oh. not a good idea that I come yeah. here because I can try everything. Yeah. Remember chocolate cigarettes? <laughs> <laughs> I've now one of these I'm in going years. To, I'm going to buy some sweeties. Look, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> thank you again. Oh, I remember this. <laughs> <laughs> Memories come before manners. <laughs> this is so cool. The Lever Street Park, which is really a hidden gem in, in Cork Bay. Fabulous for kids, beautiful in summer because they have concerts here which are really well attended and such fun. And there is a park I will play. I've been here since 1986. Since I was born. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> there's, a, there's a sense of humour, A, in, in the image and then the fact that it's painted on a kind of driftwood is just so lecker. Little villages like this, you've got to sneak down the back streets check out some of the older architecture as you can see that it's pretty cool really well maintained art park is one of my favorites because it's family run and all of them are involved in the art and the something we're not covering today are all the activities that are possible like uh, live music the theater the uh, walks up in the mountain up at the top there there's some walks to the caves and that today is very much more about the retail therapy of Cork Bay and all the trinkets and hidden gems that you find all over the show but that means there's room for more videos so let us know what you want to see next <laughs>